Hello guys, this is Deepika from mytutorialrack.com and I am very, very happy to announce that the Lightning Process Builder course is live. So what is this Lightning Process Builder course and what are we going to cover in this course? So the Lightning Process Builder is a very powerful tool which helps you to automate your business processes and it also gives you a very powerful and user-friendly visual representation of your processes. So in order to build your processes, you use this tool. What can be a process? A process can be as simple as, hey, post a message to the chatter anytime an opportunity gets created for more than one million. So that is what a process is. So this Lightning Process Builder is like a tool. So if you have used Workflow, it is very similar to that tool. And But the problem with the Workflows was it has certain limitations. There are certain th only certain things that you can do with the Workflows but it has a lot of restrictions with the workflows. But with the help of Lightning Process Builder, it gives you more flexibility. You can do more things with the Lightning Process Builder. Now, why you should take this course? What is the reason that I want you to take this course? So the first thing is, if you are a Salesforce admin, then you should definitely check out this new tool to automate your business processes. And if you're looking for becoming a Salesforce admin, or if you're looking for a job as a Salesforce admin, I have covered some very complex business processes in this particular course. So you can use those business processes during your interview to illustrate that, hey, I worked with such and such process. These are not just some small business processes. These are actual assignments that I work on on the daily basis. Now, if you're already familiar with Process Builder and you say, hey, I already know it. I don't think so. I need to take this course. If you just work with Process Builder and you wanted to learn about more complex business scenarios and how to work along with them, then this course is for you. I'm also going to provide some interview questions in this course so related to the lightning process builder so that'll be very helpful to prepare for your interview and one very important point is the business scenarios that i'm going to cover in this course are actually real-time assignments so you're going to learn a lot from this course what are we going to cover in this course what are the things you're going to learn so this course is divided into different modules and each module has is pointing on a specific action. So the first module, we are going to cover the basics of Lightning Process Builder. We are going to go ahead and walk you through the UI of the Process Builder, what kind of actions you can perform with the Process Builder. So we're going to, we're going to learn about those things in, this, in the first module. Now in the second module, we're going to go ahead and do very simple processes just to update records, how to create new records using the Process Builder. So we're going to do some two or three simple business processes then once you got familiar with the process builder ui and uh, navigation in the process builder ui we're going to go ahead and talk about some complex processes that we can do with the process builder like we will cover how to invoke flows from the process builder how to launch an apex code from lightning process builder and we're not just going to go ahead and do some powerpoint presentation we're actually going to cover the business scenarios then we're going to address those business scenario using the actions. Then we're going to see how to send email alerts, messages to chatter. So all these things will be covered in the course. Then at the end, at the end of every section, you're also going to get a lot of assignments and a lot of key points at the end of the course. There's going to be interview questions with answers related to the process builder. We're going to cover that in the course. You're going to probably have about more than six hours of video content is available in this course. So this course is going to give you a very good understanding of the Lightning Process Builder. This course is not for everybody. There are certain prerequisites for taking the course. The first thing is you need to have a basic understanding of Salesforce administration. Like you, sh you should know how to create objects, how to create fields in Salesforce UI, just the basic administration uh, uh, features like how to move around in the UI. So that is needed in order to take this course. One more thing is there is no coding or programming experience is needed to take this course. So if you if you think that, hey, I don't know programming, am I going to be learning anything? No, that's fine. We, you do not need any programming experience to take this course. One last thing I would request to you is you must have a computer to work on and also you should have an internet connection so you can you can go through this course, the complete course. 
So these are some of the prerequisites of taking the course. Uh, these are some of the very important points. And uh, I wish you all the very best. And I guarantee you, you're going to learn a lot from this course. And so go ahead and enroll in the course right now. So I'll see you in the course. Thank you so much.